This is section 5.5, the fundamental theorem of calculus. In this video, we're going to go through problem 5 in your book. It gives us this function, and it's asking for g of 1, g prime of 0, and g prime of pi over 4. So this problem looks really confusing, but actually, it's pretty simple to solve. So let's just go through this step by step. Part A is asking us for a big G of 1. So we just plug in 1 for our x and becomes 1 to 1 of tangent t dt. So you could go through this and go ahead and take the integral and just plug in all your values. Or you could realize that any integral from some number to the same number is always equal to 0. And we're just going to leave it at that. The answer to part A is 0. Done with that part. Okay, next part is asking us for g prime of 0. Okay, remember, the capital G here is representing our integral. And when we take the derivative of our integral, if you look down at this chart I drew over here, we're over here at our integral, big G of x. When we take the derivative of that function, we're just left with our original function. Or we're just left with this thing here in the middle. So it's asking for big G prime of 0. We can just plug this value into this function in the middle here, our original function. So going over here, when we plug in 0 into tangent, we get tangent of 0, and that's just equal to 0. And going on to the next part, it's the same thing. It's asking for big G prime of pi over 4. So it's asking us to take this integral and take the derivative of it, in other words, go back to our original function and plug in pi over 4. So when I do that, I get tangent of pi over 4. And tangent of pi over 4 is just 1. And that's it for that problem, too. So this problem, it looks really confusing at first, but hopefully after we went through it, it makes a lot more sense and is a lot easier to understand. I hope you found this video really helpful. The concepts covered in this video are true no matter what calculus class you're in. But all the sections and problems I referenced were from this textbook right here. And remember that if you're a registered Baylor student, we offer free tutoring on the first floor of Sid Rich. You can either schedule a one-on-one -on -one appointment online or just drop in whenever you're available during our business hours for free tutoring. For more information, feel free to visit our website.